Hi, this is Laura Cuffs from SHIELD Healthcare. I'm the ostomy lifestyle expert, and today we're going to be talking about exercising with an ostomy. It's a well-known fact that exercising increases the release of endorphins, which is responsible for mood boost and also decreased pain perception. It's also great for your bones and your cardiovascular health. These are all fantastic reasons why you should work out. When I was diagnosed with ulcerative colitis and then later got surgery, I thought my physical fitness career was over. After doing some research, I realized that I could still be fit. I would just have to change around my routines a little bit. The first important thing to do is to get your doctor's approval. Once they say it's okay for you to start working out, I would start slow. As soon as you get out of surgery, start with walking. It's important to get your endurance back. Afterwards, try some low impact exercises like bike riding or swimming. Then you can move on to running and yoga and Pilates and then eventually lifting weights. I waited about three and a half months before I started lifting very light weights again. ostomy makes it really easy to become dehydrated. I would always keep a water bottle on hand when you're about to work out. Also ask your doctor if you can take Imodium 30 minutes prior to exercising. It's also important to eat a small meal 30 minutes to an hour before you start exercising so that it can sop up some water. After you work out, get a good meal in so that your blood sugar isn't low. Because we've had abdominal surgeries, it's a lot easier for us to get hernias. So ask your doctor if they think that you can do abdominal exercises. I like to do a lot of stability exercises. I hold yoga poses like one-legged seated chair, high lunges, and also the treat pose. Make sure to flex your abdominal muscles while you're doing this to get the best benefit from your workout. Another way to avoid a hernia is to invest in a hernia belt or some Spanx-like materials that you can wear underneath your workout clothes. It's also great because it secures your ostomy in place so that working out is not uncomfortable. The best piece of advice I can give you is to listen to your body. If an exercise hurts, stop immediately. If your body tells you in the morning that today is not the day to work out, don't exercise. You can always go tomorrow. It's really important not to judge yourself because recovery is a long process and it takes a lot of patience and hard work. Just know that you can do a lot of the activities that you've done before and maybe some you couldn't do prior to surgery. So get off that couch and start exercising.